What's up, Chiguchi, everybody? Welcome back to It's Shibu. J Pets, J Puzzle, J What It Do. J I gotta put it in the bucket. I am out here on Madden 16 playing Draft Champions, the brand new game mode. I don't know if you guys know about it. You draft 15 rounds, they give you three players to pick from. You essentially draft a team together. You see what I'm doing with my squad. The first round I passed on Tony Romo and I picked up who is that Matt Forte I think and now I'm, I'm gonna pick up Russell Wilson to scramble and quota back so this is gonna be really fun folks I'm also gonna have two games in this video for you so stay tuned for that but let's see what I'm looking at right now I'm choosing between Ryan Tannehill I already got a quarterback and I already got a running back so might as well pick the right guard I think that makes the most sense and now I'm looking at this a left tackle I think I want my left tackle to be better than the 84 overall. You know, that's my blind side, right? Michael Orr on these boys. So, see, I guess I'll just pick the left guard. It's not a bad trade-off. I, I guess I could pick a left end, but I really want a good offensive line. I plan on running the ball any time in the pocket so I can make the passes to do what I'm trying to do. So, that's the selection I'm going to make right there. Let's see what I got. And I got Charles Moulton to play on the haters. You know if the Buffalo Bills play is coming up, I gotta pick them, right? That's straight up loyalty right there from my bros. I had to swoop them up on that one. And so they're now giving me CJ Anderson. I don't need another running back yet. So I guess I'll look at this. I got I got Brandon, not Brandon Cook, whatever that guy's name is. I don't need him. I just picked up a tight end. So I'll pick up another person from our guard position. That's pretty cool, right? And now I have a decision to make because I could use any one of these people to be honest. So I'm just looking at them right now. Do I want Nelson? Do I want Burfitt? Or whatever the heck you pronounce his name is. Or the rookie. Or he was a rookie last year. Bar. He was really good for the Vikings. The Vikings should be actually pretty good this year. Sad day for Jordy Nelson. He did get hurt last week. You see, I saw that. Tore his ACL out of the season. I wonder how good the Green Bay Packers are going to be. But I'm going to make my selection right now. I don't think I want to go with the free safety. Maybe I can get the legend free safety. I, see, I think Steve Atwater is in the game. So so maybe I can get him there because you know people are going to be trying to cheese, throwing the bombs, throwing the aggressive catches. It's going to be nuts, folks. And now look at me right here. Another running back. So I'm not going to pick him. I don't need another one just yet. At least. Not, and if I'm going to pick another one, he's going to have to be a really good running back, an elite running back. So I could pick this left outside linebacker, Barwin, or I could pick Macklin. I think I'm going to go with Macklin, though. Let me see what I can do. The Cowboys representing, picking them up right now. My team isn't looking too bad. And they got real deal CJ Spooker. But I don't have any wide receivers yet on my squad. And look at that speed, folks. That's like a 90-something overall. I can't read it. It's really small on my screen. But he's a 90-something for the speed. And they got famous Jameis over there. But I already got Russell Wilson. So no need to pick him up on that one so give me the give me the wide receiver and now rg3 i cannot believe that boy is a 77 my how the mighty have fallen that boy was he was the rookie of the year like three or four years ago it's crazy and stefan stephen jackson i don't need him I already got a running the back like i've been saying so let me get a cornerback to add to my squad he's not a great cornerback but he's better than what i had so let's keep it moving on to the 11th round and i got elite players now, folks, if I hadn't already picked Charles Molden the clay, I would definitely pick Greg Olson. It would make the most sense, but I want my man to be on the squad. I need the Buffalo Bills to be representing, and I already have a good right guard, so I'm going to pick up. Arian Foster, I'm going to get my second running back, folks, and maybe I can put one of, them as, one of them as a wide receiver so I'll only have one really good running back. You know what I'm saying? And now I'm faced with another choice. I already have Macklin, I think, as my middle linebacker, so it makes no sense really to pick Clay Matthews. So that leaves, leaves either Justin Tuck or an elite player in the left tackle, Smith. So I think I'm going to go with him. I told you I wanted an elite left tackle to, for my blind side, right, to protect Russell Wilson. And look at this round. All 70s? These boys trash. Well, I said before I need to get someone to cover up deep. I, 
I'm not too sure if I'm gonna get Steve Atwater. I hope I do. That's who I'm really hoping for. I need someone to cover someone deep. So just in case I don't pick him up, let me get this boy Del Moss, or however you pronounce his name from the Miami Dolphins. We don't like the fish, we squish them fish, but I gotta add you to my squad, though. Let's see what I got now for the second to last round. I don't need Stafford, so I'm not gonna pick him. I guess I could pick the center to complete my offensive line, but that is only the second wide receiver I have seen. Cooks. I'm about to be chefing him up out here, so I gotta pick him. And there he is, the boy I was looking for. Steve Atwater. That boy is a beast. Don't look at those stats. Now, don't get me wrong. Ray Lewis is tempting to pass on. I mean, that's Ray Lewis. You know how we do. But I got to make the smart choice. I got to do something against the deep passes in this game. It's freaking nuts, folks. If you guys haven't gotten the game yet, you'll experience it soon enough. The aggressive catches, they are on some other level, if you know what I'm saying. So that's going to complete my team. Here's just a quick overview. Check it out. I even have another Bills player. It was generated for me Nikel Roby I don't know if you saw him on my third my third cornerback but there's my offense I made Matt Forte my third wide receiver and my opponent has LaDainian and Tomlinson oh my god folks and he also has Marcel Darius part of the cold front but now I'm molding the clay, moving these chains on the, my first on my first drive, that is. And now Arian Foster, you know, not really getting too much there. But it's whatever, though. Rocking out the Bills unis. And look at that. He got Clay Matthews, too. Oh. Oh, he's pausing the game. Well, I guess I'll take a second to go check out his uh, depth chart, see who else he has on the squad. Let me go check that and wake up. Look at that. That boy quit on me. Why would you quit? I mean, I ain't gonna say no. I ain't gonna say nah, Madden, don't give me the win. I wanna win it fair. No, I'ma take that win. But whatever, we moving on to game two, and he has Joe Horn. Oh, I remember watching him when I was a kid. That boy's a beast, and look at me, I'm a beast. Look at these spin moves, son, can I beat him? Oh, on the very first play of the game, I'm out here getting a 46-yard run with Arian Foster. Second and one now, the play action. And look at me rolling out with my boy Cook. Russell Wilson, I hit him, putting the money on him. We about to stack him up. And now on second and go, I'm punching it in the bucket, oh. I got to put it in the bucket, oh. Taking the lead, my first online game in Madden 16. I, I didn't even play that many in Madden 15, to be honest. But whatever. Now it's his turn to see what he can do. He also has Russell Wilson. And look at that. What did I tell you, folks? He's just spamming it. He's just going to go up there and throw it up to Joe Horn. I mean, he is a good receiver. I can't blame him for doing it. And look at him again. Oh, are you kidding me, cuh? Some this is ridiculous. My boy, Steve Atwater, you got to make the play. That's why I drafted him. But now it's my turn again. Tied game 7-7, and I'm molding the clay on the haters. I'm doing it online this time, Madden Draft Champions. And now look at me. I got Arian Foster. Come on now. Oh, what? Nah, son. He was down. Don't worry about that. They went ahead. They reviewed the call, and they gave me the ball right back. You don't got to worry about it. But look at that. You got to worry about that one, son. I got to give him credit for that. That was a nice user pick. He knew exactly what I was trying to do. But on first and 10, are you kidding me? Son. All he's going to do is try to throw it deep. Come on now. Come on. Get in the deep end, though. Get on the ground. Russell Wilson, you stand no chance against the boy. You stand no chance against the beast. I got everyone covered now. Oh, look at me looking silly. Come on, Steve, that one. Get him. Give me that. I said, give me that. Give me that ball on the 22-yard line. That's what he gets for that aggressive catch cheese. And on the very next play, I'm finding Kevin White. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And out here on my opponent. Who is my opponent? That boy, trash bags. But now it's third turn. And now he actually isn't trying to go for Joe Horn. And look at this lag. Come on now, get him. If it wasn't lagging, maybe I could have got that. But now it's on second and 10. Let's see what he's going to do this time. And he's finding Hollywood, Jamal Charles, moving the chains on me. Now it's second and inches and some. He ties up the game right before the half, 
Andy gets the ball at the half. So I'm going to try to put something on the board. Let me just get a quick nine yards right there to Charles Clay. And now only seven seconds left in the game. How do you like this aggressive catch change? Give me that. I'm cooking them up on the haters. What do you want? I got a four-course meal for the boy. Look at that. With zero seconds on the clock. Come on now, that's the perfect way to end the first half. Now he's got the ball and some. Like that's not gonna go down, son. I'm I'm out here making plays. You got me once, shame on me, but you ain't gonna get me twice. Shame on you. Come on, son, look at that. All he is doing is throwing it up. It's actually pretty funny at this point. Cause now I can actually play him better on defense. And look at that, you got nowhere to go. Get on the ground. That boy trash bags. And he is going for it on 4th and 13. He's calling to hurry up. You know nothing good for my opponent happens when they call to hurry up. Come on, Russell Wilson, what you gonna do? Come on now, there ain't no one open. Oh, murder. Come on. That's how I like to do it. Now I got the ball 3rd and 2. Arian Foster, I'm rolling now, but ah. Uh, I had my man open. I was trying to mold the clay, but I just missed the throw. Come on, at least we'll go up by 10 points. Are you serious? Oh, I'm looking like a noob. Now it's their first play after that, after the missed field goal. Oh, come on, give me that. Come on now, stop trying to do it. I know what you doing, son. You too predictable. Who is my opponent? First and 10 now for me on the next play. And look at Arian Foster just bumping off the haters. Now let's see what I can do. And people, I make a mistake. So you see the clock just ran out. And now I, look at this. I lost almost all of the fourth quarter's footage. All I did on that drive, I went down there, you know, just did no, nothing huge plays. I got like a two yard running touchdown with Arian Foster to win, the, um, to get up to 28 points. And then all he did was just keep trying to bomb it. But now it's up here, fourth and 10, I don't know, fourth quarter, 10 seconds left. Come on, now you ain't doing that. I'm really upset with myself for losing that footage. I'm hoping to get a capture card sometime soon, so this won't happen anymore. But that's going to be it, folks. I'm going to win my second game, technically, but really my first game online. Like a boss, 28 to 14. People, if you want to see some more draft champions, let me know in the comment section below. Like this video, let me know that you guys are enjoying it. But until next time, it's your boy, Jay Bitch, Jay Bitch, Jay What It Do. Jay, I gotta put it in the bucket. Thanks for watching. And he hitting on what the name at all. Ooh, watch me, watch me. Ooh, look at that boy dancing, son. And look at these stutter steps hitting them with the spin move. My first touchdown.